welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video crack eel dry callous looking feet guess what have you ever been in a situation where your feet is just not up to par you are looking all mighty fine your nails are done your eyebrows are done and you're looking amazing and you just go somewhere and guess what you gotta take your shoes off and guess what you are so embarrassed <laughs> do I have to take my shoes off oh yes madam you have to take your shoes off <laughs> and guess what you pull out of those shoes crack eel callous looking feet dry feet chipped nails just awful and guess what happened to you totally totally embarrassed you don't have to be in that situation today I'm going to share with you a foot scrub that you can actually take in the shower with you that you can actually keep in your shower and every time you go take your shower you could take a little and just exfoliate your feet and when you're done you just oil it down with some Vaseline or some coconut oil and guess what guys you will never have to be embarrassed again because your feet will always be looking radiant your feet will always be looking moisturized no callous no crack eels so if you're interested in this video come with me to the kitchen and I'll show you how to whip it up in no time our first ingredient is salt and I'm using a sea salt for this recipe now salt help to soften the colors on your feet but not only that salt will help to get rid of toenail fungus it also help to pull the toxin from your feet and salt also help swollen feet if you find your feet swollen just soak them in some salt water and it's gonna help to shrink them but most importantly it's gonna help to get rid of that rough crack eel and dry looking feet our second ingredient is an exfoliator for the feet and this is in the form of a brown sugar the granules in brown sugar is going to help to get rid of the callus the dead skin cells on your feet and it will help to soften your feet our next ingredient is a peppermint oil and peppermint oil is going to help to keep their feet cool soft and supple our next ingredient is vinegar and I'm using white vinegar vinegar is good to help to pull toxin from your feet but not only that it make a great soap for your feet to soften all those colors and dead skin cells on your feet now take a look at the next ingredients which is coconut oil if you do not have coconut oil for this recipe go ahead and use some olive oil or even some almond oil you can even choose to use some soybean oil or some corn oil in this recipe. Our final ingredient is tea tree oil and tea tree oil is antibacterial. It will help if you have foot fungus. It also will help with toenail fungus and it will help all those cracks on the feet. And not only that, the tea tree oil will help to moisturize your feet. So to begin, I'm going to start with the brown sugar. If you do not have brown sugar, go ahead and use white sugar in this recipe. We're using the sugar mainly to soften the feet from the granules, the rough will have to exfoliate the feet and get rid of the colors and I'm using a quarter cup of brown sugar which is 60 ml and use the same amount of white sugar next I'm reaching for my sea salt if you don't have sea salt guys go ahead and use your table salt and I'm gonna be using two tablespoons of the sea salt which is gonna be 30 ml If you don't want to use sea salt for this recipe, you can substitute it and use some Epsom salt, okay? So now I'm just going to mix the two dry ingredients together. Mix in the brown sugar with the sea salt. And next I'm going to reach for my peppermint oil. And I'm going to use a few drops of the peppermint oil. Use your discretion with this. About 5 to 10 drops is good. I'm reaching for my tea tree oil. Use your discretion with the tea tree oil also. I'm just going to use about 
five to ten drops and before I add anything else I'm just gonna blend this in just mix these essential oils in the sugar and salt and once I'm comfortable with it I'm next gonna move on to the oil and to begin I'm using one tablespoon of coconut oil one tablespoon of any oil you're gonna use and that is gonna be 15 ml next I'm moving on to the vinegar and I'm using the same amount one tablespoon of vinegar 15 ml pour this in and now I'm just gonna blend everything together like this and this have a wonderful fragrance now and here it is this is your foot treatment for callus for corns for crack eels and also for a detoxing your feet so now I'm gonna move on and I'm gonna show you how to use this wonderful foot detoxer foot scrub foot treatment to get soft feet to get rid of callus to get rid of stinky feet to get rid of toenail fungus just a wonderful wonderful treatment to treat those minor issues that you have going on on your feet so here we have the foot scrub and this is best used in your shower or if you have a bathroom stool you could just sit on it and you're just gonna be generous with this And I'm just going to exfoliate my feet with it. So just exfoliate, focus on the eels, wherever you have your corn and your callus, exfoliate. My eels tend to get dry easily, so I'm exfoliating. And this has a very pleasant fragrance. Now remember, if you have fungus in your toenails, don't be afraid to rub this all over your toenail for athlete foot right in between and just exfoliate three minutes or more i tend to spend a little longer the top of your feet is just as good and your ankles these two spots right here where it tend to get very dark and dry just exfoliate And once you're done, next we're going to rinse off with some warm water. And then you're gonna pat dry your feet and apply some foot lotion. So there you have it guys. Easy peasy, easy, easy foot scrub. Go ahead, make this, keep it in your bathroom. Use it two to three times per week. Get rid of that crack eel. Get rid of that dry, callous looking feet. And have your feet just pleasant looking. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.